Hello curious people. Today we have an interesting video for you. Did you ever think that when you're in the big box store looking at that beautiful laminated particle board that you may be able to put that in your home and make it beautiful? Well today we're going to show you how that's put together and how SDRG controls helped one of our local Texas companies take a machine that was built in China with the help of the original manufacturer start it up and start making beautiful particle board in Texas. The laminate plant covered approximately two stories with most of the controls and electrical instrumentation up on the mezzanine with in-feed, conveyors, out-feed, etc. going through the lower floor where the particle boards were transported to finally being stacked up. Bundles of fresh particle board are loaded on the conveyors and fed into the machine. The bundles are then carried up an elevator where they can be fed individually into the feed system. The individual boards are then slowly pulled off the bundle with sizing sets that only one board gets through at a time. The boards are then passed beneath inspection stations and go on to where they're heated and treated for further processing. The whole process is automated so that when the next bundle is required, it automatically goes into the conveyor and automatically is raised by the elevator. The elevator that's holding the existing stack sets it on top of the new stack and the process continues to go on without interruption. It is an amazing process to watch when it works right. Encoders are used throughout the machine so that they can precisely measure the boards as they pass through. The board thickness is a very key component because that sets the elevation of the spacings where the board must pass through so they can limit it to only one board going at a time. The length and width are required so that they sand the edges after the laminates are applied and it makes it a finished piece. In addition to the encoders, we also set up many operating screens and converted the Chinese screens to English so it was easier for the operators. After the boards were laminated, they passed through two sanding stations. The sanding stations had to be precisely measured so that they fit both the sides of the boards and the ends of the boards, and this was all done through the encoders. Once the boards passed through the sanders, they were then placed on a final conveyor which allowed them to exit into stacks for transporting out of the system. After the boards were stacked and the bundles were counted, a completed bundle was then transferred to an area where it could be strapped and wrapped ready for shipment to the customer. On the upper floor, there was many pieces of equipment usually just the tops of the processing equipment below, but it also contained racks and racks of electronic gear, from motor starters to variable speed, speed drives to uh, PLCs, communications devices, electronic starters for the heaters, and other such equipment. All in all, it was quite a complex, elaborate, and complete system. We appreciate you listening to our video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, please press the like and subscribe buttons, and we would really appreciate it. Thank you again.